Hi, I'm Mark Tillerson. Uh, welcome to another instalment in the sequence of how to use Google Plus for business. Uh, this time we're just focusing on how to deal with spam. Uh, unfortunate as it is, uh, we can't have a social network without spam. That's the whole point of spam. So first option, uh, go to the menu, go to your settings and change the way that you receive notifications. Uh, notification spam can be a big problem on Google Plus unless you manage it correctly. So first you can decide who can actually send you notifications. Um, so uh, if someone invites you to um, a community for example, um, your extended circle. So people who have been circled by people in your circles uh, is my current setting. Uh, you could always change that to just people you have circled if you want to. That will limit uh, people outside of your circles from uh, saying hi and meeting you. So just think carefully about, about that. Uh, who can comment on your public posts? Uh, again, if you're here to build a community and reach out to people, then I would set that to anyone personally. But again, it's up to you. Uh, notification delivery. Uh, you decide where your notifications are delivered and how, and then also how you receive your notifications. And then you can decide how these are delivered, or in fact, if, if you're notified at all. Uh, remember that these will still appear in Google+, Plus. it's just whether you actually get an alert for it. So just think about how you receive notifications, and just take a balanced view as to uh, how many of those you would want, and how many are going to be spam. So that's just in your menu here in settings, and that's how you change your notification settings. So the second way uh, of dealing with spam is if you go to a profile of someone who is kind of annoying you, spamming you and sharing rubbish content you're really not interested in. Uh, Buffer wouldn't be a good example of this. Uh, they produce some really good content, uh, but you can mute them. Uh, now, if you mute a page or a person, that person won't be notified that you've done that, uh, but you won't see uh, any notifications from that person. Um, if it is really, really annoying, um, then you can report or block using this second option here. Um, so that's how you do it just at a, at a personal page level, straight from the profile. Uh, the last way is if there are particular comments, uh, then you can report spam or abuse straight from the comment um, so if somebody is being particularly rude or offensive or just trolling, uh, just annoying everybody, then you can report that. So that's how Google Plus is set up to help you deal with uh, spam uh, and rubbish content. Uh, and it will help you keep your stream full of useful, interesting stuff with people who you actually want to speak to. Uh, until next time, I'm Mark Tillerson. Thanks for watching.